Data shows that retailers will handle $850 billion of returned goods in 2025. Data from Happy Returns, a UPS-owned reverse logistics company, shows that nearly one in every 10 retail returns in the U.S. involves fraud. Retailers now lose $76.5 billion a year to this fraud problem. So to slow the losses, Happy Returns, which specializes in store returns for online purchases, is testing a new AI tool that flags fraudulent returns before refunds go out. The new AI tool is called Return Vision. It starts working the moment a shopper initiates a return online. The system looks for unusual patterns across return timing, frequency, and location. A single return may appear normal on its own, when those signals overlap in suspicious ways, the return is flagged for review before a refund is issued. At drop-off points, workers can scan item barcodes and see photos of what the item should look like. They can reject obvious mismatches on the spot. Once returns reach happy return hubs in California, Pennsylvania, and Mississippi, flagged packages are sent to human auditors. The items are opened and photographed, including images of the front, back, and identifying labels. These photos are fed back into the AI system, which compares them against official product images and past transaction data. Human teams review the AI assessment and make the final decision. The goal is not automation alone. It is adding multiple layers of review where fraud is harder to hide. Early results show how effective AI is at catching return fraud. While still in pilot, Happy Returns says return vision is showing early results. Less than 1% of returns flowing through its network are flagged as high risk. Of those flagged returns, about 10% are ultimately confirmed as fraud. The average prevented loss per confirmed case is just over $200. Customers find and buy. So there's a lot of bad shopper behavior out there, a lot of scam, a lot of fraud, a lot of risk today. But companies like Happy Returns are experimenting with AI to find suspicious patterns and protect retailers from being taken advantage of.